would be exciting if there were a relatively simple intervention that had a major role in reducing risk of heart disease, stroke, cognitive decline, diabetes, and many other chronic diseases. So there are federal guidelines, U.S. Department of Agriculture guidelines for healthy nutrition. They're pretty general, pretty broad-based, having lots of fruits and vegetables, whole grains, fish, minimizing red meat, minimizing added sugars, but there aren't really specific things such as taking a, a certain supplement might be able to f reduce risk even further. And so we're interested in testing promising bioactive compounds and uh, dietary supplements to see if there may be additional ways to improve health. Um, even am among those who follow a heart healthy diet, is there a way that they can do even better in terms of chronic disease risk reduction? And so the uh, cocoflavanols look promising uh, in having a role in reducing the risk of heart disease, stroke, cognitive decline, maybe even having um, a role in reducing diabetes. So we're interested in having a, an evaluation of the cocoflavanols in a large-scale randomized clinical trial and actually see if um, in a study where they're placebo controlled, do, do we see uh, a reduced risk of these major chronic diseases? I don't think there's been as much emphasis on the importance of nutrition, physical activity, healthy lifestyle practices beginning early in life as there should be. Uh, there's a little more attention to it now because of the increased prevalence of obesity in children and adolescents, but really this is such an important area in terms of really minimizing risk of chronic disease starting early in life with uh, healthy nutrition and um, life, healthy lifestyle practices that uh, it, it would really be far preferable if there could be more emphasis and actual systematic programs to help uh, young, to help children, adolescents, and young adults, as well as older adults, really implement these uh, lifestyle modifications that can be so important for good health.